Right, all. Yeah. Exact uh, mundo. Turn that nonsense off, Nige. Come on, Ken. Chop, chop. Right, who's got the short straw then? I have the cokes for me. I'm driving. Right. You got my weed chaser, Ken. What time are you working till, lads? Just a couple more hours now. Time for this and a quick one in the oak. Should be time to clock off after that. Right. You've been busy today, Ken. Snowed under. What about you, lads? You're all right with us, but if one of these rookies clocked it, you've had it. Oh, I know, yeah. I don't know where they get them from, Ken. <laughs> when you need O levels these days to be a bobby, what's all that about? They're all right in training college, doing the dissertations, but when it comes to real coppering, I haven't got a clue. Yeah. Uh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey. Did you hear about the off license on the corner of Burton Street, Ken? What? It was done over last night in the early hours. What, again? We got anybody funny? We were very close, Ken. What happened? Somebody living opposite saw them breaking in and phoned 999 straight away. So the station radioed us, but we were picking our Katie up. She'd been to a club in town with her mates, and by the time we dropped all them off home and shot up to Burton Street, they got away. Scum. Bloody scum. That's what we're dealing with, Ken. Scum. Keep your eyes peeled, though, Ken. They started to offload the dodgy booze and cigs in the pubs now. Right, OK. Do you know where the disabled badge is? I'm going out straight after my class. Aren't you working tonight? I was hoping I could have the night off. Well, you, you had a night off last night. Please, Dad. Mel, you have more nights off than Father Christmas. Please. Go on, then. Oh, thanks, Dad. Hey, Mel, you've not seen anyone in here selling dodgy booze and ciggies, have you? Only you, Dad. <laughs> Bugger logs. Have you seen it, then? It's in there. Do you need another one, Ken? We can soon sort that out. No, you're not. Right. We're here somewhere. Hello, right, lad. Sorry about that. I don't know. Another night off. You're too soft with her. You're making a rod for your own back. Well, it's hardly the Munich Beer Festival in here, is it? Anyway, she's a good kid. I don't think she's a kid anymore, Ken. Oh, don't remind me. Is she still serious about finding a real dad? Yeah. Is that why you're being as soft as shite with her? Hey, if I'm ever seven storeys up stood on the window ledge, I just hope it's not you two who's sitting round to talk me down. Do you want a top up, Nige? Oh, uh, go on. Just a little one. Hey, uh, this isn't from the off-license robbery, is it, Ken? Now, you know me better than that, lads. You got any idea who did it, then? Yeah, we got a tip-off from a grass. Reckons it's a gang from the Lowfield Road estate. I'm not surprised. It's like Beirut down there, isn't it? Is it? I don't know. We won't go up there if we can help it, and if we do, we don't stop. The blue light's on, we're straight through. I don't blame you, lads. Keep your eyes peeled, though, Ken. Like we said, we're going round the pubs trying to offload it all now. The grass was definite about that. Will do, no prob. Who is the grass, anyway? Can't reveal that, Ken. He's in the witness protection programme. Is it Vinnie Pace? Yeah. Uh, don't be expecting Joel back just yet, Duffy. He's having a shit. Cheers, Eddie. Oh. Joel's just having a shit, John. Oh, is he? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, that happened to me on Mrs. the other day. She went to see her sister for a quick brew. She's only been in there two minutes. Next thing, the car alarm goes off. So they go out to see to it, and some young scally's legging it down the path with a car stereo under his arm. In broad daylight, this was. Bloody hell. Did she report it? Well, what's the use? You're right, it's terrible, isn't it? <sighs> anyway, see you soon, Ken. We better get off. Crime can't crack itself. <laughs> Cheers, Ken. Hey, Ken. Go see you soon. Come in, lads, and make yourself comfortable. Where are we doing the tick? All right, Ken, no rush. The usual. Just please, Ken. Go ahead, Steve. Hi, ma'am. Can you send Mel down, please? Pinky and Perky here again. Right, thanks. Oh, mine's the bitter he's driving tonight. Who, hey, lads? So, how are you, Ken? Everything all right here? Fine, no problems. Hey, before I forget, four weeks on Saturday, we're having a day out from here. 
We'll be all right for after time when we get back, won't we? Oh, I know, problem. But remember what we said, keep the curtains closed, will you? Oh, definitely. So where's this day out to, then? We go to York Races for the day. Then at the night, we go to the Bamboo Pool Dancing Club. Bloody hell. It's not them sisters, Twin Cheeks, is it? Have you seen him? I'll say. We had the station Christmas too there. Cracking night. We had a ball. <laughs> hey. Hey. They're not real sisters, you know. How do you know? I looked them up on the database at work. Oh, bloody hell. They're not even related, Ken. Hey, you won't spoil the magic for these lads in here, will you? No, I won't send out. We've got some tickets left if you fancy it. Oh. I'll say, we'll have a bit of that. Hey, to the regiment! I, I wish, wish I was there! there. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we had a good one yesterday, didn't we, Nige? Oh, well, I. What's this? Oh, this to God is true, this is. What? We were on desk duty down at the station, weren't we? Yeah. This woman comes in to report a flasher. Well, what's funny about that? Oh, wait a moment, you're not heard yet. All flustered she was. She'd be walking back from the post office, and this bloke pulls up beside her and starts asking the directions. Yeah. He's got a map in his lap. Oh. Anyway, she's telling him the way. Next thing, he pulls the map away. He's got his bloody todger out. <laughs> the dirty get! I know. So she shrieks, he speeds off. Anyway, she's telling us all this, and we're having to write it down for the report. Yeah. And she's giving us a good description of him. And then I says to her, and you've got to ask this, by the way, was he in a state of arousal? And she says, no. He was in a Ford Escort. <laughs> <laughs> Bloody hell, we cracked up! <laughs> Even she had to laugh when we explained it to her. <laughs> 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 Who was he? No, oh, bloody hell, Ken. 